Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Code Prime. Welcome back to another Lumber Tycoon 2 video. I am so sorry. I missed the orange present yesterday, and you guys told me about it. You're like, Code, you forgot the orange present, which is right here. And everybody knows what it's going to be. It's, it is a wobbly head. Bobbly wobbly. It's a wobble, wobbly bobble. Bobble head. Of most uncertainty. Or something like that. Most uncertainty. I can't. I can't eat it. So, let's go. Where is a truck? I want a truck, please. Zink. Have to take it up here. Now, the reason that these are kind of cool and kind of help out a lot is because. Oops. What happened there? Is because they have. Whoa. What? Pump. Well, the phys the physics me messed up. What is going on there? Is that with the all wobbly heads, or is that just just this one? Hold up! Hold up! <laughs> That's got to be a bug with the, the actual heads themselves, right? No. It's a special feature. Okay, so this wobble head's doing just fine. What in the world was going on with that one? That's got to be programmed like that. That's, that is a script. That is an intentional script. That is not a bug. No way. Hold on a second. <laughs> oh, <laughs> completely missed code. Uh, could you imagine taking a whole bunch of the bobbly heads, setting them up on all the same level and making a floor? Out of them and as you walk across the floor they start to fall but if you bounce it only falls when you touch so wait <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, okay, okay, okay. That's not working quite so well. So let's move this. Jump over. Hit B. So if you had a, a whole bunch of these. Hold on. Maybe, is it just the one? Uh-oh. <gasps> Uh-oh. What happened? Did I break it? Did I break it? No! Don't break! What about another one? No! That was a bug. It was unintentional, but it was amazing. Dang it. <laughs> Alright. Let's take this guy over. And we will attach them to the back of the truck. Hopefully, uh, if if I can get to attach and then unattach, maybe it will help. Out. What? What? Hold up. No, 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 no. You're not doing this. Nope. Come back over here. Drop it on the ground. It can't be locational, right? Okay. Still falls. Still falls. Still falling. I'm on the ramp. Still falls. Falls. Falling. Falls. 
falls. Falls. So what? What the? What is going on here? Okay. Let's take it back down to the original location where we started. Uh oh, just dropped it. Okay. I will drop it here. We're going to start our uh, our adventure. Grab it and run all the way up with it and see if it's maybe how long we held on to it. So drop. What are you doing? <laughs> I don't have that much stuff on my base. I promise. There's no way that that's working. Oh, where'd it go? Oh, no, no. Okay, it's stuck up there for a second. So let's test this out. Okay, this one. Come again? <laughs> We're just gonna go back and forth and then stop. Maybe, is it distance? No, it's not distance. It's gotta be something to do with the grab and where it was opened at. Wait, it could be. Hold on a second. So. Did you see the original position that it was in, right next to that head right there? I'm gonna walk around a couple times. See if the server's messing this up. Okay. I'm gonna drop the head right there, but then I'm gonna step right here. Ready? There. <gasps> it's like a teleport. I don't know, is anybody else getting this to work? Is that is that happening <sighs> thank you guys for telling me to come back in here and test out the uh, wobbly head of definite uncertainness or whatever this thing's called I totally had intentions of coming in here and building the uh... oh wait did it, did it it's not attached why is it not attaching <sighs> okay Let's take the car. Wait, is it going to stay in the back of the car? Oh, okay. Okay. I'm okay then. It transferred up here because. Why? Why did it transfer up here? Okay, and now it's on there. So, <clears throat> here's, here's the thing um, the wobbly head, yes, it does have an upward body mover that's why they land the way they do that's why they land right side up because there's a slight force pushing them upward now this one's acting weird just because I don't know why but here jump in the car All right. that should get rid of the weirdness and then grab and place place it on there come on Get on there. Get on. Please. Attach. Oh, there it goes. So that's why whenever it attaches to your, your hitch, it goes up like this. And you can you can tell that there's a upward momentum push of force. It's not enough to help you out, okay? Because if it were, it would be lighter than itself, meaning the head itself, if you were to put it on the ground and it started rising up, that means it would have some upward force. But because it does not rise, it does not give you any help in uh, stabilizing your truck. Okay, so it's just it's just a bobblehead for the the back of the truck. It's just oh, okay. Now my car can't move. Is that due to the new physics or what? What's going on here? I know that was a bug there for a little while. And we can't push me. Hmm. 
I'm sure we could still fling the truck though, right? Hold on. Floors type four. No, the the truck itself is no longer physical. So something has happened to the truck. If it were still physical, then uh, I would be able to rotate it with the blueprint. But whatever's happening here with the uh, the bobblehead being stuck on the back makes it where it does not move. So this head down. How much time do I got? I've been recording for ten minutes. So I wanted to make a bowling alley, but I don't know a good spot to do that at, unless. We were to make it right in here. Hold on, do we need do we need lights? We should put up some lights, right? Maybe some Christmas lights. Hold on. Are these the original Christmas lights? Are these the ones that Defaultio gave me? I don't know. But I'm gonna go ahead and put them up, just in case. I was sitting here wondering, why is that not um working? Is my axe sign still? Yeah. Hold on, which ones are these attached to? Why are we going off two of these? Hold up. Is that the whole wire? Oh yeah, that goes around the uh, the X sign. I don't want to move that. Hmm. Okay. I don't know why I've never come back in here and fixed that. But let's draw a feed off this right here. We'll come over here. Is that too far? Almost a little bit too far. Wire's too long. Why is still too long? Wait, what? Wait, 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 wait. Why is that wire too long? Okay, right about there. Finished. And then we should grab a neon, a scion, a Crayola. Is that too long? Yeah, it's too long. Oh, oh, E. Finish. Ooh, nice and bright. I think that's what I made the uh, neon axe sign out of. But this will give us a little bit more light to play with. Come on, come on. Right to the top, right there, please. There. Finished. All right. So now we have some scion. Scion, since scion, crayon. I don't know. Whatever color that is, the bluish color. There we go. Oh, oh, oh. Scusa, scusa, scusa. Pardon. That's too long. Finished. Yay. Got a little bit of light for the bowling alley. And let's let's make the bowling alley down here. You know, I haven't built anything right smack dab in the uh, the middle of this stuff lately. Let's just get this all out the way. Is that a candy cane axe? That needs to be saved. Throw that in there. Throw these over here. Come on, get out the way. Get out the way. Candy cane next. Save it. Get out the way. Just kind of clean up a little area right here. Move. All right. Let's see here. I think this would be perfect right through here. Move all this stuff off the side. Is that a bowling ball? No, that's a. That is a pumpkin. That's a pumpkin too. 
And that's a pumpkin. And this is my sign. Code Primate. Hello. Grab that. Put it over there. Just, just get out of the way. Just get out of the way. We are building today. All right. Done, done. Kind of. Okay. Let's see. Um, oh, we got to zoom out. Let's go with a large floor. And, oh, should we do two large floors? And then let's just go this direction. One, two, three, four, five. I think that's, uh oh, whoops. B. Move. I don't know why that didn't attach. It's because I don't have enough light. I can't see. Okay. Uh, I feel like it should go two more. Two more. Large floor. One right there. And we're not going to be able to get that one in because the toilet's in the way. Of course. Alright. Move, toilet. Get out the way. Move this off to the side, because it's out of place. Move this. Move. Alright, is that lined up? Yeah, that's good. And then move. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Please. There. Okay. So I feel like that is long enough. Um, yeah, it looks good. Looks good. Since we have so much gold, should we do it out of gold? Oh wait, I had some uh, some palm over here. Let's do some palms. All the other kids with the palm tree, something. Never mind. <laughs> All right, let's put these down to onesies. And good. Now we should be able to just drop it in. Nope, that's sideways. Hold on, hold on. Turn sideways and drop. There we go. That'll go in. Now, I don't remember if this is actually hooked up or not. I can never remember. Oh gosh. Does this actually work? Here. Get the spook out of the way. Get the blue out of the way. Get that out of the way. It's gonna to be too long, isn't it? Oh gosh. You can't cut it yet, silly goose. But once it's done growing, it should should chop off the access right there. Oh, right. Oh, 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 okay, it's it's kinda of working. It's not intended. <laughs> Chop, chop. There we go. We'll grab this one. Toss it back up in here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why are you getting all wonky on me? Get over here. If you haven't seen this video, by the way, this is the one unit sawmill. One unit chop saw. Which isn't one unit. It's a little bit more than one unit. Boop. But it works great for building. Dang it. Maybe not. What happened there? Hold up. Why did you fall down? <laughs> rotate, turn. Rotate, turn. And rotate, rotate. Is that the correct direction? No. That's the wrong direction. Turn, turn. Rotate, rotate. There we go. That's the way that we want it to go. Now, can we get it any closer? That should work. Okay. Oh, 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 drop. Boop. 
Hold on. It's not chopping anything. Why aren't you chopping? There you go. Now chop it. Took a second to react. There we go. Drop. Drop. Come on. Now you might be asking, why did I stick it up in the air like that? Why did I give it some extra space? And that's so I can put gutters on the side. Uh oh, 92. Not quite the one unit we were looking for. Ooh, it's doing half units. Maybe I should move it up a little bit more. That'll be okay. Oh gosh. Yeah, we made a lot of units, didn't we? Dang it. Alright. A lot of not so one unit sawmills. <laughs> I'm sure I figured it out whenever I did the original video. Which was so long ago, Code, in a land far, far away. Called Lumberland. Yes. Oop, that's a good one. It's a little bit over the unit. Done. And then we should be able to destroy that one. Destroyed. Now, how wide do you think these lanes are going to be, or need to be. <laughs> no, wait, which one was it? It was, was it this one? Yeah, that's the one that's the bowling ball. The bowling ball. So for it to become a, a gutter ball, it needs to be as wide as the ball. So right about, right about there. So. Let's go out, and I would say if we look at the walls, smooth wall, and we did turn like that, maybe one unit in, that only make it one unit wide, wouldn't it? Hmm. So let's do, let's do, let's do these. All right, come here, you. Come here, buddy. Go move you out of the way for a second. Let's put this one here. 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 Boop. 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 And a boop. And then. Boop. By the way, it would be quicker to set all this stuff at the end of the sawmill. And then that way, as you were building it, it would fall down for you. Come on, let's get you out of here. You are just too close. And I think I would have had an easier time just tossing these in by themselves. Like just... Just take the, the log over there and chop it as I'm using it. So. Whoa, that was still too small of a piece. Ugh. Sixty one, come on, done. I'll use up these little pieces and then we'll move on to actually chopping. Boop. Only that now that song is stuck in my head, and it's not a song that is like it's it's about a very serious issue, but it's so catchy, such a catchy song. Shouldn't be singing it. No, 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 no. Happy thoughts, family friendly. That's what this channel is all about. That's why we're here. To watch code build something by messing up the chopped wood code. Okay, okay, I get it, I get it. All right, let's just grab this whole thing. Let's go. For buying. Okay. Choppy chop time. Two chops. 
chop, 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 chop. Nope, that's too small. Chop, chop. Dang it. Too small. Fine. Oh. Right there. Right there. Are the lanes usually white? I can't remember. I thought they were made out of wood and then like wax to a polished shine. Hmm. Oh, also somebody said that uh, you can take the ham up to the mountain and it does fry. So you, you can have fried ham, I think. Uh, hold on, B, get out of that, out. There we go. Let's use a small or a smooth wall on these as well. But we're going to angle it up like that. That way it doesn't go over the sides, but it's not too bad. It'll be like the lane separator. That way, if you wanted to make multiple of these, you could. These are the things that the guys walk on when you have a bumper ball that doesn't go all the way down there. If you don't know what bumper ball is, it's amazing. It's amazing. Bumper bowling is awesome. Especially for like little kids and stuff. Come on, come on. Oh, we're at 26 minutes. Oh, geez. Um, way off on that one. I guess not way off, it's just slightly off, but still felt bad about it. No, get in there. There you go. All right. Using up a lot of palm wood code. I don't know. Whoa, 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 whoa. Grab the wrong piece there, buddy. If you guys haven't seen it, I have like an entire storage shed of palm wood and I have access to more palm wood if I need it which is kind of the reason I like using it just because it feels it feels less rare because I can get it so I don't mind building with it oh no 98 percent let's see do I have any more palm wood over here that's a, that's a slice. It's a little slice of palm wood. Combined with this little slice of palm wood and it's too small. Nope, got it. Sweet. So let's head over to our palm wood. Hello, ladies. Ladies, look at your man. Now look at me. Now look at your man. Now look at me. <laughs> By the way, those, those, that's the Old Spice commercial. Boop. In you go. And I think we could we could probably turn this thing off. Because I don't think it's going to work properly. So let's just, let's just move this out the way. We'll move it right there. You come on out. You do your thing. And we'll, we'll actually detach, detach this. Move. Finished. Oh man, you got all wonky off the side, didn't you? It's like, I don't want to go that direction. I'm going this way. Okay, you do you. Palm. Do not drop that entire thing inside there. All right. I've done that before. Knocked a piece of wood and it just, the whole thing's gone. No. <coughs> if you can't tell, my voice is feeling a little bit better. I do feel better. So thank you for asking. I hate allergies. They're the worst. I'd rather I'd rather just get sick, you know. Because sick you can get over pretty fast, but allergies just feel like they last and last and last. And then I'm not trying to complain to like anybody else. Just ugh. 
takes forever. All right, what should we do here on the back end? This should catch, right? So let's do rotate. Is that too tall? No, I think that'll work. That'll be fine. Yeah. And then let's do walls, smooth wall, smooth wall, smooth wall. Got one. Oh, can we do a short smooth wall? One short smooth wall. Nope, that's too short. Short smooth wall, that one. Nice. And then that'll, that'll catch the ball, or it should. We're gonna need to bring all those pins down here, aren't we? And after I drew, I drove them all up there. No appreciation, no appreciation at all for the funness. Boop, there we go, okay. So, we'll set our pins up here. Ball down there. Let's just test it real quick, see if, uh, where's my ball? Hello. So there's two ways you could bowl. You you could hold on to it like this and be like, boom, and then let it roll, right? Or you could get some momentum on it, stand here on the side, and be like, shabang, and then it gets gutter balled. Oh, that works as a gutter ball, though. Look at that. Wow. That's awesome. All right, I'm going to set it right there. And we're going to come up here. And we're going to grab some pins. <laughs> I think I should be able to push these along, right? Yeah, let's just do this. Push, 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 push. Oh, that's going to take forever. Push. Sweep. That's taking too long. Let's just drop these off the side. Hopefully they don't bounce too hard. Two, three, four, five, ouch, six, seven, oops, come on, seven, Eight, nine, ten. Wait. Wait a second. Oh, out, 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 out. Okay, Google. Search for images of bowling pin setup. Showing pictures that match. One, two, three, four. How many pins are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There's ten pins? Are there ten pins or twelve? There's only ten pins. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Is that standard? Am I missing something? No, it's ten pins. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Fibonacci sequence. Or no, regular sequence. So one. Two. I could I could totally pause this, right? And just set this up, but then you wouldn't see the work that goes into it. So I don't know that you would appreciate it as a video. Or plus this is this is kind of like a relaxing base cleanup, right? Yeah, I think so. Is that five, six? I feel like I'm counting down somebody into hypnosis. <laughs> Seven. <laughs> I don't like it when my voice sounds like this. Ugh. Okay, I like it sometimes, but not like this. I just sound sick. Is this eight? Hold on, how many is this? 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, that's eight. Just need two more. Two more. Nine. And ten. So I think green and red wires to kind of simulate like a... Oh, what is it? A um, <clears throat> arcade. I think that would be right up my alley to make it look pretty good. Come on, come on. So the only problem I see is losing. Oh yeah, that's not gonna, that's not gonna fly. Hold on. Oh gosh, I just like really messed him up. Okay, you're gonna get stuck under there. So you need to go right over there. Then I hit B. We're, we're gonna need to fill that in. We have to fill that in. Let's go ahead and get, um, what is that, post? Where's the post? Take a post. Stick one there. Stick one there. And we can fill those in real quick. Chuck. And chuck. Good. Okay. Then we have to get these out. Come here. Boop. One, two, three, four, five. How did I go from five? Okay, six. Seven. I'm still missing three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Where's eight, nine, and ten? <clears throat> There's eight. Oh my. Okay, let's just see how hard or easy this is going to be. One. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Two. Three. Oh gosh. No. We're gonna have to like make little divots or something to hold these things up. What? Stop, stop. Just drop it, just drop it, just drop it. And I'm gonna have to get a picture of this before. <gasps> no, stop. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is so bad. <sighs> you know, I, I could probably, I, the thumbnail, I can just make the thumbnail look good in production at the end. You know, this is, this is a lot harder than it looks. Just saying. Hold on. What if... Oh, 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 oh. Here, 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 here. What if we did this? What if we drop it into a corner first to get it set upright? That way it's it's nice and flat. Oh, dang it. Dang it! Where did it go? I'm gonna lose my bowling pins. These things are unstable. As with most meshes, they are. Whoa, 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 whoa.
It's not centered. No. <laughs> you know what? It's good enough for a screenshot. <laughs> Where's my bowling ball? There we go. And let's go get some light on this thing. Because that sun, it's going to come up and we're just not going to have enough light because the, the top's going to cast shadows and stuff. So. Let's set this right here. So it casts a nice bright light there at the end. And then, do we have lights on over here? We do not, but that's fine. There we go. What's a, what's a good screenshot? Is that, is that a good screenshot right there? Right there, maybe? Then we can put in some post-production effects of some kind there we go oh i should get my head out of the way hold on roblox logic tech cam and tap can we tap out of that there we go cut there we go that'll be the screenshot of awesomeness i like it oh i guess i should test it out before i jump off right right we need to test it all right, let's give it a test. Ready? And go. Oh, gutter ball. Totally, totally redo. I get a redo. That's a redo. Ooh, that thing is heavy. So, run, 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 run. Wait, why did it? Redo, redo. <laughs> there it is. Go, buddy, go. <laughs> oh, I'm glad I bought some extras and just I, I didn't stop at 12 or 10 or whatever it was. I think I had a total of 16 that are on there. So, oh, got myself a little bowling alley. We're gonna have to have some bowling competitions. Oh, gutter ball! But we're gonna have to definitely have a better way of setting this stuff up because I could not imagine setting that thing up 12 times for 10 frames. 10 pins, 10 frames, 10 times. And then if you've got like multiple players and stuff like that. Oof. So. Or does anybody have a way of auto loading them? Hmm? Hmm? Look up those systems. See how they work. See if you can't get it to go down a, a wire or something. Hold up. Hold up. Can we do that? Hold on a second. There's. There's a bowling pin. Let's bring one. Oh, hold up. There's another bowling pin. Found him. So, could you essentially. Oh, hmm. Ideas are happening inside my head. Rotate, turn, rotate, turn, rotate, turn. Okay, so I will initialize the idea but somebody else is probably going to have to make this up. So, what if you have a wire? Come here, wire. What if you had a wire? Does this move with the wire? I wonder. Wait, which direction are we going here? Oh, we're going the wrong way. If you had pins that could sort themselves. <laughs> Ideas are happening. You'd have to find a way to get, in, get them to fall just right. It'd, ha it'd have to all be made out of wires too. But then you could have it like fall have some wires that catch it, line it up, and it lands just straight down. I mean, that would have to be a perfect bottle flip every single time, but, you know, if you get it flat against a wall. 
Hold on. Can we get it flat against a corner and drop it? It's still pretty unstable. So, not sure that that's feasible, but ideas sparking interest. Powering imagination. That's that's what it's all about, powering the imagination. So, that's it. Thank you everyone for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate, as we build a uh, bowling alley from scratch with uh, the new gifts from Christmas 2021. Love you guys very much. Have a great night. We'll talk to you soon. Outro.